ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, or gags of all ages. I am Double R, and in this particular video, I wanted to do three topics, but we're only going to be really doing one. Why? Because the three topics, well, two of them had different things that happened. I'll speed through it real quick for you so we can get them out the way, so we don't have to worry about it later. Topic number one, I wanted to deal with this. The whole Joaquin Phoenix walking out of a movie five days before filming. I found the article that brought this up. Thankfully, they said Variety. All I had to do was look through Variety's stuff and bada boom, bada bing. But the Variety article stated pretty much that the entire staff of the movie stated, quote, it was Joaquin Phoenix's idea to do it. They were pretty much on board because he was on board. He pushed for it. They got the green light. And then all of a sudden he got cold feet, bounced out. There are things I was going to point out about that, but I'm leaving that alone. Because trust me, the topic that came up in there will be brought up later. We'll get there when we get there. Bear with me. Topic number two that I wanted to fully discuss, but we're not going to really fully discuss it. We're just going to skim over it. A role player stated, if you are following a canon account or a canon character and you're expecting them to be a certain percentage of canon, you're out of your damn mind. Stop telling people how to role play because everyone by default is AU. That's pretty much a summary of what they said. On my account, I said, yes, I agree. And a couple days later, they got rid of that statement. Why? Well, they do tend to role play with a lot of type two types. This is fucking ridiculous. I'm Batman. That's, that's who Batman is, me. Not anyone else, all right? Some asshole can dress up like Batman and pretend to be him on a YouTube video, but does that that does not make him Batman because I am Batman. You understand? There's only one person that could be Batman. That is me. Me. The character is me. I am the character. That is me. Who I am. Batman is me. You don't give a shit about facts. It's all about fiction. What validates and makes your fictions real? Feelings. I'm just saying. So there was probably some argument there, or they just clear out every few days. I've seen some accounts do that. So whatever. Whatever the reason, they deleted that post. They're not wrong, but whatever. If you're not endorsed by the IP owner, the intellectual property owner, if you're not endorsed by the company that owns that IP, if you're not told specifically you represent that character wholeheartedly, by our standards, if you're not given any of those, you are not canon. I'm sorry. Once you state anything outside the lines written, you're not canon. If you roleplay with any character that is outside the universe, you are not canon. You get the idea. I can go on for a while about this, but we're not going to. We're going to go on to topic three. Topic three is, well, let's do it this way. I had a DM. They sent me a DM. Someone sent me a DM. Called me a hypocritical jackass. Jackass. That's uh, that's one I haven't heard in a while. Whatever. I was being called a hypocritical jackass. And the reason why they can say this is because they found proof and evidence of other people agreeing with them that I am. And they sent the YouTube link. And then they made the little block me so I couldn't respond to them. So I'm responding to them. Te technically, I literally don't do these specifically for the DMs, but this is something interesting. Because I thought maybe they went through some of my videos, found two hypocritical moments, put them together, and then went, ha ah! ha! But no, they didn't do that. For some reason, they brought up, um, hold on, before I bring up that specific clip, let me state this. I've already answered this before, but we'll go into a more in-depth answer now. So what do they bring up? So here's the thing. You know damn well you're not monogamous. To we call are it, on off camera. Right. So it's like going into the metaverse is not necessary. There, there, there's no life on camera and life off camera. It's either, there you're, is. either you're monogamous or you're not monogamous. If you got a movie role and second, you yeah, kissed a girl in the movie role, would you still be monogamous in your relationship? I mean, I realize that the sex thing is more of a whoa, real physical whoa. fact, right? Did you well, compare a movie no. kiss? You compared a movie kiss to your girl getting smacked well, down? It literally by is. A, they're making a piece act. of content. They're making a film. I actually agree with him. I would say that's, that's not no. being monogamous. I feel like you're 
you're yeah, intentionally you misunderstanding what I'm saying. No, not at all. Not I mean, it's all. pretty obvious that there is a difference between doing things off camera. Let me and ask on you a camera, question. Right? If you think I'm intentionally misunderstanding, you think if we took a poll right now and we said, would you consider Adam's relationship monogamous? Would people vote yes, it's monogamous, or no, it's not monogamous? Obviously, it We're comes with, with a very be. big caveat that says, why must off, there be a caveat? On camera, the rules are slightly. But different. that's the whole point. There's no caveat. You're creating a no, there false is a caveat. frame. I just named the caveat. You're creating I think a, everybody a false here frame. actually understands it, right? Yeah. No, yeah, no, I mean, that's every, not true. Everybody, you see all no, the girls no. on their head? No. <laughs> that's because you have three conservative individuals here, and then you have everyone else here is in yeah, sex work. She, seems, she just says she understands Dude, what I'm I saying. Right? She's not in sex work. She's. <laughs> <laughs> I yeah, would say. Yeah, but why did you put her yeah. between. <laughs> this is right. confusing, right? Oh, yeah. Because she's pretty, and I need her next to me. No, I'm just saying, like, like, yeah, it would be like conservative and then only fans like on girls. Oh, yeah, they would on, switch. Hold on, just, to hold on, just yeah. to one sec, guys. Mr. Adam 666, <laughs> do not insult our intelligence. Your wife is a sex worker. There is no monogamy. Mm. You are the one pretending. Oh, settled. I'm a sex worker as well. Settled. So, yeah. Correct. And what was my response? Because I have answered this before. It was a movie. It was a movie. If you haven't noticed, I am not actually a gay cowboy. I did not actually stick my penis into Jake Gyllenhaal, okay? As I'm sure Ewan McGregor did not actually stick his penis into you. Right? <clears throat> right? Oh, Christian. Oh, Christian. I'm a method actor! Dude, now, this is ridiculous. <laughs> I can't. Wow. Wow. I need five. I need five. I'm afraid I'm the one that's going to take the ass. <laughs> yes. Strangely, I've done this before. Now, I'm going to go with one that... I'm going to go with a response that is off-handed. And then we're going to talk about the main hand response, okay? During the whole lolly show discussion bullshit. How did we get back to this? I brought up the issue with Shadman. Apparently he got hit by lawyers from Daphne Keene, pretty much telling him to take down a certain picture because the picture was of X-23 and Wolverine fucking. The problem with the drawn picture of X-23 and Wolverine fucking wasn't because they were fictional characters, as Shadman's defense was, they're only fictional characters, it doesn't matter. It was the fact that X-23 can be identified as Daphne Keene. Why is this a problem? Well, it may not be a 1466 immediate hit, but the lawyers are gonna go after the 2256 issue first, because they can get that to stick, they can catch him on the 1466. The issue was, Shadman's defense stated, these are fictional characters. I'm fine drawing these fictional characters. The lawyers pointed out, no you're not. We can identify the underage character. If so facto, it's a 2256 violation. And this is where a lot of people who argue against Lolly Show seem to miss it. You have to be able to identify the minor exactly who it is. You have to be able to point out, boom, this is so-and-so. And that's what the lawyers were pointing out to Shadman. Yes, it's fictional characters, but you designed X-23 off of Daphne Keene. It looks like Daphne Keene. We can identify it as Daphne Keene. If we show 10 people this picture, 9 out of 10 of them will go, that's Daphne Keene. If so facto, it's a violation of 2256. That would put him in trouble, so he took the picture down. That was the indirect way of dealing with it. Now, let's talk about what was used with the clips. Definition of pornographic film. You notice something in the definition. They are actually doing the do. They're, 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 they're doing the do. They're chugging the Mountain Dew. The piston is going in. They're fucking on camera. Snuff films. People are being killed on camera. You know, like beheading videos. And as we see on this definition here, some people watch such things for pornographic reasons, you know, to get off sexually.
I'm not going to go into that. But I do know of a certain YouTuber who admitted to watching beheading videos because he was interested in them. But he didn't specify what the actual interest was. We'll leave it there. You can infer if you want. I'm not saying anything on record. I'm just saying it's a little odd. But some people like snuff films for more than just a sexual thing. Maybe he was just interested in how fast the head can come off. Hmm. That said, the reason why I brought this up was because Adam 22, Adam 666, whatever it was on file, whatever. Apparently they never decided what the numbers actually were. He said his wife is in character on camera, so they're not actually fucking. But it's a pornographic film, bro, which means they are actually fucking. Let me help you understand this in a better term, because even other OF people were like, we totally agree with them. <clears throat> Negative. This is why. Brokeback Mountain it has implied sexual moments. Many movies have implied sexual moments. Does that mean they actually fucked on camera? No. Does this mean they actually fucked? No. But the characters did. They did not even remotely fuck. But the characters did. Let me give you what I mean by implied. This picture implied. Um... Anakin Skywalker walking into the place with a bunch of younglings. Master Skywalker, what are we going to do? And he turns on the lightsaber and then you find out that they were fell by lightsaber. It's implied that Anakin Skywalker killed the younglings. This does not make Hayden Christensen a murderer. Because he didn't actually kill the younglings. In fact, there's pictures after the fact where Hayden Christensen and the youngling who said that speech, or that line... He's older and fine. Another example. Just, I'm going with the snuff side first because I want you to catch up here. Nightmare on Elm Street. Robert England was Freddy Krueger in that series. The character Freddy Krueger ran around, killed kids. Well, killed teens. Claw, stab, dead. Johnny Depp happened to be playing a character as well. I believe the name was Glenn. The character's name was Glenn. Well, Guess what happened to Glenn? He was murdered by Freddy Krueger. Correct me if I'm wrong, but didn't Johnny Depp make commercials after this movie? Didn't Johnny Depp make movies after this movie? You know, like, I don't know, something about pirates and a Caribbean and eyeliner and walking around like something, you know what, 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 you know what. You know what? You know, he was fine. Because the murder didn't actually happen. This is why it's a movie and not a snuff film. I shouldn't have to explain this, but here we are. So, with that in mind, we go back over to, say, Brokeback Mountain. The example that I used from a skin. He didn't actually fuck the other dude. He thought you didn't actually bang the other guy. He did it. But it was implied. Why am I emphasizing this specifically? Because when you're doing a pornographic film, the fucking is on camera. The fucking is actually happening. It doesn't matter if the person calls themselves Wonder Woman, Power Girl, Asuka, doesn't matter if they go by Ray, doesn't matter if they go by Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, doesn't matter if they go by name Chi Chi, doesn't matter if they go by the name of Power Ranger Pink. It doesn't matter what they call themselves on the camera as a character. The fact remains they are actively fucking ergo and dustly why it's considered a pornographic film and not a normal film. There's no pretending to fuck, they are fucking. Cleanup has to be done after the fact. They are actually doing it. If so, and... Simply stating that, that tells you, yes, Adam, your wife is fucking on camera. She is actively fucking on camera, just under a different name. Now, 
in your defense, Adam, if you and your wife agree to these things, if you and your wife are down with that, then fine. You've agreed to it. But do not, do not misrepresent shit like that ever again. She's actively fucking on camera. Period. But she's in character. Doesn't matter. She's actively fucking on camera. Let me help get you to understand this. If she's on camera and someone stabs her character and she bleeds out and fucking dies, oh, her character's dead on camera. So is she. But when it comes to stuff like that, you prop it up. You use props. You fake the killing. Because you don't want your wife to actually die. You see the difference? Now, having said that, does that prove I'm a hypocrite? <laughs> no! Because it's proven that I am correct. I've done it before, I've done it again, and I've proven that I've dealt with this in two other cases, so now I'm dealing with it specifically here. That said, I know. Role players, role play on, and the rest of you, party on Wayne, party on Garth. Darth Vader, I don't care. Just have a good day, or have the day you deserve. Just have a good day, all right? Later.